Hello everyone, welcome back to Restoring Ghettos Forgotten. I promised that I would be back with a part two of dealing with the controversial topic of child support in the African American community. So that to, I'm coming back with the second part of it. Forgive me, I'm still out and about. I'm an extremely busy person. And um, so I'm running another errand, uh, this time with my daughter. So I'm out here in the car waiting on her, but I thought I would go ahead and finish this video because I may actually be uh, out and about showing houses later. Uh, but I wanted to go on from where I stopped and, and bring up the point about single fathers because there are plenty of good hardworking single fathers out there that have that have their children they take care of them you know they don't ask the mother for anything and i think being coming from a male perspective like they believe that because they are a man they should foot the foot the whole bill but i don't think that's fair because if they're if they're there all the time and the you know the non-custodial parent isn't there and she's not paying child support and she's not doing her part i think she needs to uh, be held accountable just like you know the brothers do sisters need to be held accountable too so i'm just making the mention because there are a lot of good single fathers out there that are, that are supporting their children alone and so again i go back to um they weren't made alone so we need to do a better job at supporting one another and how we do that is we learn how to how to engage one another in a positive way how to respect one another and how to be there for our children one example could be we all know this type of female they're my sisters i love them regardless but we all know there are some women out there that never have their children never absolutely never 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 ever and so the kid is always either with the father or relatives most and if they are with the father and the father's footing the whole bill why is it ladies that we expect to still collect every benefit out there but we never have our children anywhere from afdc food stamps medicaid um everything child support but you never have your child you know that's something we have to deal with on a human level you know get out of our emotions and start putting our children first because you should feel accountable for a child that you help create i mean the child came out of you so why don't you feel accountable or responsible for that child so we got some work to do you guys this is going to be a really short video because i just wanted to touch on the other side of it we're always giving the brothers a hard time we're always calling them out but we also have to call ourselves out out on certain things that we're not doing too we're both uh we both are you know should be responsible for our lineage and the children that we bring into this world so uh overall this video is about making sure we come together uh well enough so that we can um come to a common goal on support the support of our children giving each each and every one of our children a fighting chance you know making it to where they can um compete out there in this world that doesn't want to you know give us a chance or, or anything we want we need to create our own opportunities we need to create our own chances and how we do that is we work together we get over the fact that the relationship did not work out for whatever reason you know and we put the kids first we work together for the good of the children and how we do that is we have to be we have to get healthier we have to get whole and I may just be dreaming, I don't know, but that's just how God created me. Uh, but I may just be dreaming. But it's my hope that one day we will become healthy enough to co-parent, <coughs> excuse me, to co-parent with one another, to be respectful, to be mindful, and to participate in the support of raising and rearing the child of the children. So again, like I said, this, this part of the video is gonna be extremely sm um, small, but I wanted to finish it out because I had to cut off um towards the middle of my video and i wanted to address the topic that there are some women out there that are not holding up their their end of the bargain either we must do better you guys gotta go see y'all later love y'all bye bye